door, so there's a couple of kinks I need to hammer out. Oh, there we go. Hi, everybody! <laughs> hey, 24! Long time no see. Okay, I will just stealthily remove these alias commands because apparently I do not have a great understanding of what they do. <laughs> I will in entertain you with some music in the meantime. How's everybody doing? I'm kind of excited to get back to this. I've tried to, you know... Oh, i tried to do some research, which means reading codex entries and just studying the talents and everything a bit in a bit more detail. You know, stuff like that. Thank you, Prings. That, yeah, <laughs> that's nice of you to say. Okay, hopefully as I remove these command aliases, the timers will actually work. You think it's amazing? Well, thank you. <laughs> hey, sick pirate, welcome back. Yeah, it's been, it's been happening for a handful of times now. Was it? A week ago that I started this. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> hey Dragon Bitsy, what's up? Okay, I'm almost done getting set up here. I will just move some windows around. Hope everyone's doing splendid. I'll need to put OBS here. This is a nice song, but I will have to interrupt it. Yep, it's gonna be a blind playthrough. Yeah, I think it was, I mean, it was a Monday. Yeah, it was a Monday that I, that I started this thing. And I, I guess it's a week ago, yeah. Two different streams. Um, well, uh, we left off at uh, Redcliffe Castle last time. Okay, there we go. We didn't uh, finish the castle. I already had a very tiring battle behind me. And, you know, I, I don't know how long this mission here inside the castle is. I'm saying mission because I've been playing so much Mass Effect. What I mean is quest. It's called quest in this game. Hello, Mecca. Oh, welcome, everybody. Okay, hopefully the game is loud enough. Oh, wow, what is this? Is it snowing inside? Ah, it's dust. Here's uh, the Witcher. The Witcher decided to join me. A sorry witcher. <laughs> no spoilers, though! I mean, for all I know, this could be the final room. So. <clears throat> we got everything set up nicely here. Wait, why are these people smoking? Is Marion doing something? Oh, oh, it's the frost weapons. It's the frost weapons, guys. It's okay. Thank you, 24. I appreciate that. As you can see, I have my quick bar very nicely uh, organized here. I got my primal stuff, you know, all the, all the cryo and fire and electricity, the tech, the tech stuff. Here I have heal, rejuvenate, uh, debuffs and buffs, you know. And here's my my uh, restoration items. I did the same for for my my, my teammates, my companions. <laughs> On fire! Oh, I, I've done it plenty. Yeah, I've done it plenty. But but that that would have been their their uh, frost weapon sort of. Not smoking, but I don't know what it's called. Anyway, let's get into. 
hand unlock. Story of my life. Deep mushroom. Of course. Uh, we won't need those. Loot. It will be done. <laughs> you got cake? What kind of cake? Steel bracers. Oh, I should give these to somebody. I wonder if, um... If Stan would like them? Listen to this creepy music, can you hear it? Fancy vase. Probably for selling. Love letter. A collection of embarrassing personal communications between Steeler, thank you for hosting, between the spoiled wealthy and their ob objects of possession. Oh, hold on. I need to fix something. There we go. A counter for how many times I kill my own companions. Oh, come on. I heard them, but I usually heal them, you know, heal them back up. <laughs> I think, I don't know if I've ever managed to kill my own companions that I have in the party. Actually, it, it's possible, but how did you mess up your dinner? My darling Reginald, I burn for you and because of you. Please, use the enclosed tincture, if our love is to endure. Sari. You are filthy. A beast. Wait, I read this already. Maybe. No. No, I didn't. Such depravity, I have never been forced to suffer. How words are so laden when they leave your lips is No, I did read this. How come I picked it up just now? I don't- I don't understand. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing! <coughs> Hold on now. There's supposed to be a door here. Oh, wait. Ah! Courtyard. Okay, so it was just- just a room. Quick save. <laughs> ah, throwing bombs, I see. The head of the quote department. Well, any mod can add a quote. Ooh. Area unlocked. I also changed my uh, squad tactics a little bit. Hopefully, we'll see better results. Gate lever. Oh, shit. Huh, so we need to do some fighting out here in the courtyard. Where are they? Uh oh. There's a lot of them. There's people over there. Okay, ice. Oh, here they come. Shambling corpse. Well, I noticed, uh, you know, right away because I went through all of these one by one. You know, and it's over here and then, you know, you get the, the notification. Alright, guys, let's get to it. Uh, Morrigan, could we have a vulnerability hex, please? I can't recall which one I targeted, though. <laughs> Run while you can. Oh boy, they're taking some punishment. Holy shit. I'm gonna see if I can unlock this. Oh yes! Oh yes. Very nice. Wipe them out. 
look at all that ability usage. <laughs> okay. I think the, the the previous battle was actually um Whoa, whoa! Alistair, wh where are you going? Alistair? <gasps> Stan is dead! Oh my goodness. Stan is dead. Stan! We have lost him. I am your death. No, 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 no! He's gonna hurt me! Uh Okay, what's Morrigan doing? Not much, I think. I set her to be passive. Okay, let's pause here. Well, everybody's doing okay except Sten, who's a little, you know, dead. No, he's not. He's not dead. <laughs> yeah, I said Sven a few times. Okay, what can we do now? You good, Alistair? See, I put all his uh, sustained abilities down here. Let's not activate that. Let's have him... Revenant. Okay, you shall attack the Revenant. Okay, we need to debuff the Revenant here. Woohoo! Um... Weakness. Yes. I am attacking the, the Revenant, right? Let's do vulnerability hex and let's have Morrigan follow up with some some stuff. Yes. Lightning. Passive aggressive. <laughs> yeah, I noticed that because I set my two of my squad to uh Aggressive and two of them to passive. Uh, drain life. Whoa, 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 whoa. Time to heal, uh... Alistair. Oh, but I can't. I may have him use a lesser health poultice just in case. Oh, she used more mana. Damn it, girl! The Revenant is very tanky. Okay, Alistair, we will... Well, fortunately, we have a lot of guys fighting here. Shield... Bash. It might be we're unable to get off its feet. Yeah. But this is going well, though. Even if Alistair dies, these other guys might just be able to, you know, figure it out. Okay, we, we don't need Alistair to die, actually. No, 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 no. We don't need Alistair to die. These, these guys can handle it. Alright, Morrigan. Do your thing! Wait, does she have weakness? No. Hey, we're done. We're done. Is that all my blood? Thank goodness I noticed this straight away. We're not done. Sir Perth here is... Oh, he's still alive. That's great. He's not letting down, though. So be it. We're letting letting up. What? How do you say it? Yeah, we lost uh, Sten. I don't think we battled any mages. He's like, he's he's still in, in the zone. Skeleton. Hey, hold on. <gasps> oh, I never loot them fast enough. Hello? What's happening? There we go. Oh, can't do it while paused. <laughs> yes, Lyrium potions! Hey, Savage. What's up? He is still clearly uh, fighting something. Hello? Uh, 
is he done? Sir Perth, you done? No. Okay, well, I'll just leave you to it. <laughs> hey, thanks, knights. That was great. These people should be thankful for your timely arrival. I know I am. Without you, we surely would have perished. Many good folk died here, but now is the time for rebuilding. With luck, we may yet restore Redcliffe to its former glory. I'm glad you're optimistic. That's why I did all this. Didn't do it so you'd all just, you know. Oh wait, that's Morrigan. Landmark tree. I don't understand what this is. Like, you can't... Nothing happens when I... Distinctive landmark. <clears throat> of course. Okay, then. Injury kit, good. Stan will be injured now. Hey, Luke. Yeah, he appeared a little traumatized. Something wasn't right. Is he still going? Yep. Maybe he went mad. He just lost it. Auto save. Can I go out here? Village. Oh, area transition. Wait, what? this was the main gate. This was the plan. Was it? No. Yes? Yeah, I think that was the main gate. I didn't realize until now. <laughs> Nice. Got some monies. Okay, we're ready to go inside. Main floor. Yep. Yeah. Hey, what's up, Brown? Sorry, I didn't see you there. We just cleared the courtyard of Redcliffe Castle, and we're about to head inside. How are you doing, Brown? You doing okay, Sammy? We're sacrificing a bit of Morgan's uh, mana to keep up the frost weapons. What's that? Kind of looked like a lever. No, it's just for the candle, the torch. Oh, Ben Tegan. Oh, he's in here. Guard. Okay. Hey, he's in pretty good shape. Was he being controlled by the boy? Or was he just trying to amuse? So these are our visitors. The ones you told me about, mother. Oh my god. Yes. Connor. His voice. And this is the one who defeated my soldiers. The ones I sent to reclaim my village. Yes. And now it's staring at me. What is it, Mother? I can't see it well enough. This is an elf, Connor. You... You've seen elves before. We have them here in the castle. Oh, I remember. I had their ears cut off and fed to the dogs. The dogs chewed for hours. <laughs> Shall I send it to the kennels, Mother? Connor... I beg you, don't hurt anyone. Ma mother what? What's happening? Where am I? Oh, thank the Maker. Connor, Connor, can you hear me? Get away from me, fool woman. You are beginning to bore me. Great Warden, please don't hurt my son. He is not responsible for what he does. How do you even- I mean, I've read about demons and stuff, you know, bad stuff from the Fade coming into this world to, you know, possess things, <laughs> indoctrinated, <laughs> yeah, those Bioware themes, huh? My face? What? Hey, what's up, Unk? Yeah, but, uh, I don't know, like, how do you get rid of them? How do you banish them? I don't know. Um, 
what did you wait that's kind of it's kind of obvious he was being controlled or something or he went mad <laughs> hello kikai well thank you for stopping by hello <laughs> hope you're having a great day so he is the evil force you speak of it's kind of understandable that a mother would protect her child i guess no don't say that i just did so, the boy has become an abomination and sundered the veil Connor didn't mean to do this it was that mage the one who poisoned demon he started all this he summoned this demon Connor was just trying to help his father and made a deal with the demon to do so? Foolish child. It was a fair deal. Father is alive, just as I wanted. Now it's my turn to sit on the throne and send out armies to conquer the world. Nobody tells me what to do anymore. Nobody tells him what to do. Nobody! <laughs> Quiet, uncle! I warned you what would happen if you kept shouting, didn't I? Yes, I did. But let's keep things civil. This woman will have the audience she seeks. Tell us, woman, what have you come here for? Hey, he called me woman, not elf, or, you know, dog snack. Yeah, Kai, I would say based on what I've seen so far, of this game, I would say, yeah, you know, play it, save it for yourself. <laughs> Make both demons touch butts. No spoilers. <clears throat> yeah, he's he's very much acting like a lap dog right now. Okay. Uh, I need to see Arl Eamon. So you're a concerned well-wisher. Why didn't you say that in the first place? All this sneaking around and killing is so unnecessary. But father is so very ill. We really shouldn't disturb him. Isn't that right, mother? I... I don't think... Of course you don't. Ever since you sent the knights away, you do nothing but deprive me of my fun. Uh -oh. Frankly, it's getting dull. I crave excitement and action. This woman spoiled my sport by saving that stupid village. And now she'll repay me. Oh shit, man. He possessing all these guys, man? Well, he just said he fed elf ears to the dogs, you know. So, you know, even if he doesn't feed us to them whole <laughs> okay um, is that the lady let's get a nice tactical view here Isolde what was her name all right uh, they're all just guards no special special enemies in here Ooh, let's start somewhere Vulnerability Hex, Morrigan, you follow up with that. Sten, you attack this guy. Alistair, you attack that guy. Or, I don't know, maybe that guy. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh... Where'd she go? Oh, she's running away. Good, good, good. Realta, do the flame. My power is yours. Okay, sweet. I'm kind of enjoying this. You know, as long as it's going well. <laughs> I kind of uh, forget that letting somebody die has repercussions. You know, they get this injury that you want to fix up. All right. Maybe take a little bit of distance here. Okay, excellent. Uh, turn that one instead. Uh, 
what are those guys doing? Maybe they're, I don't know, maybe ranged attacks? Yeah, I don't know. I heard a lot of people say that, oh, like, yeah, Dragon Age Origins is a great game, but, um, the combat sucks. I mean, what? A ban Tegan? We have to battle him? Oh, shit. He's gonna hit me. Morrigan, you two move a bit further away. Um. Uh. Does well, he's he's already. Let, let's not do anything. Okay. Well, maybe we'll just stun him. You know, make him faint. Uh, yeah, I mean, of course, you know, it's it's very different to anything I've ever played. Where shall I start? But, uh, you know, that, that doesn't make it bad. Hey, wh why are you coming for me? Stop it. Stop in your tracks. Sir? Weakness. Come on. Do the thing. Stan is out of stamina. Shield back. Oh, is he dead? I hope not. Alistair is under some penalties here. Everybody's health is looking good except mine. Oh, I can heal myself. And take a Lyrium potion, maybe? Yeah, that'd be good. I really need- I was looking uh, through my skills and stuff, spells, for something that would restore mana. But, you know, I, I mean, I assume that the target needs to have mana in order for you to be able to uh, drain mana. And I haven't fought many mages yet, so it might be of limited utility. Struggle. Blame yourself. Well, yeah, the the game does tell you, you know, what you can do. But uh, yeah, there there's a lot to to take in. There's a lot to learn, you know. But it's all there. You just gotta go and and figure it out. Okay, what's happening? Where's Sten? Oh, Sten is over here, battling two guys at once. Poor woman is over there. I don't even know where the boy went. Maybe he'll appear as some kind of boss. Once we fought his minions. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't think the, the combat is disastrous by any means. Okay, let's do... Powerful swings. Actually, let's start by eating a deep mushroom. Oh, it doesn't restore that much. But it's okay. Let's do powerful swings. Hold on. Hey, hey, hey. Taunt. Stan, you okay there? Yes, continue attacking that guy. Now we deal with this guy. Oh, I'm out of mana. That's not much. I would love for my mana regeneration to be a bit faster. I noticed that once I've, you know, used all the spells I want to use, I'm like, Oh, I'm out of mana. And I don't have too many potions. That's great. I will have to level up my, uh, what is it? Willpower? I am ready. Okay, perfect. Just one more. You will not win. And he was frozen solid. Tegan. Okay, we did it. Oh, Tegan. Oh good, he's not dead. Right? I am... 
better now, I think. <laughs> my mind is my own again. Blessed Andraste. I would never have forgiven myself had you died. But you were much more entertaining that you. way. Ban. What a fool I am. Please. Connor's not responsible for this. There must be some way we can save him. I don't know about, you know, banishing demons. You knew about this all along. I... Yes. I didn't tell you because I believed we could help him. I still do. I'm sorry, my lady, but Connor has become an abomination. He's no longer your son. I've read about you! abominations. You did this to Connor! I didn't. I didn't summon any demon. I told you. Oh, it's Jowen. Please, if you let me help. Help? You betrayed me! I brought you here to help my son, and in return you poisoned my husband? This is the mage you spoke of? Didn't you say he was in the dungeon? He was. I assumed the creatures had killed him by now. He must have been set free. That was some... some, some pretty convincing desperation. Or, I don't know, rage. <laughs> Thanks for hosting, Stegen. Call the priest. Uh, I thought he'd be useful, seeing as he helped start this. Useful? After everything he did, he should be executed! Without him, none of this would have happened. Your secrecy made his actions possible, Isolde. But I... I know what you must think of me, my lady. I took advantage of your fear. I'm sorry. I never knew it would come to this. Well, I shan't turn away his help. Not yet. And if Connor is truly an abomination... He's not always the demon you saw. Connor is still inside him, and sometimes he breaks through. Please. I just want to protect him. Isn't that what started this? You hired the mage to teach Connor in secret, to protect him. If they discovered Connor had magic, then they'd take him away. I thought if he learned just enough to hide it, then... Thank you for hosting as well, Lost Crack. Um, well, Dean, uh, I don't know yet. You know, if, if I enjoy this game once I finished it, um, I might look into maybe getting Dragon Age 2 because I don't have the other Dragon Age games. So, we'll have to see. <sighs> Jowen, what can you add to this discussion? The demon in Connor needs to be destroyed. Killing Connor is the easiest way to do that, certainly. But there is another way. A mage could confront the demon in the Fade, without hurting Connor himself. What do you mean? Is the demon not within Connor? Not physically. The demon approached Connor in the Fade while he dreamt, and controls him from there. We can use the connection between them to find the demon. You can enter the Fade, then? And kill the demon w without hurting my boy? No, but I can enable another mage to do so. It normally requires Lyrium and, and several mages. But I have... blood magic. Uh, Stegen, I did get the free stuff. The, you know, stone prisoner. I don't recall if there was anything else. Well, this sounds pretty risky. You think I'd allow you to cast a spell? Any spell? Maybe not. But all I'm saying is that I can do this. I don't understand. I, I know nothing of blood magic. But how is that an option? Lyrium provides the power for the ritual, but I can take that power from someone's life energy. This ritual requires a lot of it, however. All of it, in fact. So, someone must die? Someone must be sacrificed? Yes, and then we send another mage into the Fade. I can't enter because I'm doing the ritual. Maybe I shouldn't have said anything. It's not much of an option. If someone must die, might as well be the demon. Hey, Saxon. Gukvel. 
Yeah, people have different opinions about the different Dragon Age games. Oh, the timers are working now, that's great. Someone is gonna die either way. Indeed. Either my son or the sacrifice. Oh, well, of Let course, she will volunteer. Then. I will give my life for his. What? Isolde, are you mad? Eamon would never allow this. Either someone kills my son to destroy that thing inside him, or I give my life so my son can live. To me, the answer is clear. Blood magic. How can more evil be of any help here? Two wrongs don't make a right. It does seem like a sensible choice, with a willing participant. Connor is blameless in this. He should not have to pay the price. You're the mage here, not I, my friend. It's you who would be going into the Fade. The decision is yours. Oh boy. Stegan likes them all. Yeah. What's better? <sighs> oh. I'm not sure the risk is worth it. Save my son and you will be rewarded. That I promise. His life is worth more to me than anything. Even my own. <sighs> oh, this is so savage. There must be another way to enter the Fade. You can find Lyrium and more mages at the Circle of Magi, if they would even do it. No, that'll take too much time. Then there's not much more to say. Something else will need to be done. <sighs> you can't keep your promise if you're dead, my lady. Tigan will know the promise I made, and he can convince Eamon to uphold it. I'm not certain my brother would be very thrilled to learn we sacrificed his wife to blood magic. You are mistaken. He will see that we saved his son. If Connor dies, he's left only with a wife who... who lied to him. Are you sure you're ready to die, Lady Isolde? If there is even a chance to save Connor, I am. You rest your hopes on this young mage? He poisoned Eamon, and he could take your life power and attack for all we know. He would be a fool to try. No, I am willing to take his word. I would give my life for the chance to undo what I have done. I still do not agree, but it cannot be my choice. Okay, Dean, catch you later. Thanks for stopping by. Oh yeah, I haven't even thought about the next Dragon Age. <sighs> then I know what we must do. My son awaits your decision. Make it quickly. Will a Jowan cast a ritual? Thank you. If this will save my son, then I am not afraid. Then who will go into the Fade? Will it be you? <laughs> Morrigan can do it. Nah. Well, let's see what she says. I notice you do not ask me first. No matter. Oh, wait. Know, as I am She's really gonna go? Slave. You have my eternal gratitude. May the Maker go with you, madam. I certainly hope not. That would be rather distracting. Then let's... Let's get this started. Will she get the job done? Oh, wait! I will just play as her, of course. Oh shit. I I guess. I'll just transform into a bear and slam the shit out of that demon. But what if you don't have a mage at this point? Or maybe you can send Morrigan away before this. Oh shit. Was dramatic. Okay, I guess I'm Morrigan now. She disapproves? You said it would be... 
useful. <laughs> God damn it, Morrigan. Okay. Okay. We got this. Let's put a health poultice down here. Alright then. Stay away from me. I'm a bear. Is that you, Connor? I can hear you! I'm coming! Let's save. The fade. Yeah, some cool things happening. Father! Where are you? Is anyone out there? Hello! I don't understand. Is so Arl even in here too? I want to go home. Maybe he's uh he's dreaming. If he's sick. Portal. Please, father. I only want to help. Here he is. Blessed art thou who exists in the sight of the maker. Let's go say hi. Oh, there's his bed. You there? Have you seen my son? I can I can hear him, but I cannot find him. This blasted fog has me turning in circles. This is the Fade. Your kind cannot navigate it any more than you could navigate a dream. I don't understand. Where is my corner? I will find him for you since I foolishly gave my word that I would. Leave me to it. No. No, you're trying to lead me astray. I do not believe you. Connor! Connor, where are you? <sighs> Foolish man. Curse this blasted darkness! Why can I see nothing? So be it. <laughs> Hello, Steeler. And uh, thank you for the host, in case you were not here already. On we go. Thankfully, Morgan has... Mo oh, here he is. Has most of the... You know, that's pretty good stuff. Who are you? Are you the one that made father ill? Tell me now. I do not have time for fool children. Now tell me where this demon is. Fool? You won't get me out. I won't let you. Oh. Hi. But if I transform into a bear, I can't use health stuff. I hope Winter's Grasp is gonna work. Yay! Oh wait, I didn't need to do that. You cannot Okay. Disorient. No, it looks like I'm winning. I do it. I do it. Yes. What? It disappeared. <laughs> Maybe I go back now. Lyrium vein. Can I go around the portal? No. What? Why can I see those things if I can't loot them? Hold on now. Doesn't look like there's other ways out of here. 
Maybe I just need to go through the portal. Oh, look. There's something floating in the distance. Is that the, the, the city thing, I wonder? Maybe it is. Supposedly, you can see it from every spot in the Fade. And, uh... It, it's it's equally far from from uh, any point. You, you're the one making father sick. In the vein. I'll help him. You can't stop me. Wait, where am I? Connor. Oh, second encounter, huh? Why do you keep hurting me? Why are you trying to stop me? Attack. Trespasser! I will drive you out. Hello, Pyrrhus. Freeze. I will destroy you. Oh, it has. She has a helper now. Shit. Uh, mind blast. Flame blast. What are you doing? Stop it. Well, the demon is gone. But the lesser rage demon is still here. Drain life. No, don't hurt me. Horror doesn't even work on these things. Oh, good. Something worked. Yes, Trixie demon. Morrigan is done listening to it. Get out of here! You have to get out! Connor? No. Is that you? I will not. I guess I'll just go back. We meet again. Okay, maybe we should save. Father Wonders seeking me, trapped within my web. All is as it should be. Why must you interfere? Hey, it's not me, it's Morrigan. I gotta stay in character. No. It is time for you to go now. Do not persist, or things will go very badly for you. Cut! You said it was time for me to go. To me, pretty thing! Okay. Let's snap freeze these guys. Oh wait, I don't have snap freeze. Never mind. Okay, it's gone. It's gone. I have no idea if this even works on the demon. But let's hope. Does this work on me? Uh Hey, you. There we go. Freeze. Okay, there we go. I shall do it. Oh, this should be good. All right. No problem. Yeah, Morrigan doesn't have snap freeze, unfortunately. I could give it to her, I think, next time we level up. I think her magic level is sufficient. Quick save. <sighs> it seems, it seems, you know, one one thing, My all, or you know, all my playthroughs have something in common. I get called a monster at some point. Oh, here we go. I want to loot this stuff. Maybe this is the last arena if we're going to have, you know, time to walk around and loot a bit. Very well. No more illusions. Now we meet face to face. You see my true form and stand in my domain. It is here I am most and yet, I have no wish to engage your power, nor should you be so eager to engage mine. Perhaps we should converse instead? 
force a final confrontation. Do you take me for a fool? I know better than to bargain with your kind. Alas, that is sad. Very well then. If you wish a battle, you will have it. Let us see if your power matches your boldness, creature. I bet you'll summon a bunch of friends to help you out, huh? She looks pretty cool, but yeah, super lewd. Hello, Mikey. She was vulnerable to this. That's nice. Running out of mana a little bit. I dare not transform into a bear because I can't heal if I do that. Uh oh! Actually, let's first do vulnerability hex. Resisted! No! Resisted again? Does it have some kind of resist phase going on? Uh, mind blast. You Come on, get stunned, you wench. Wahaha, <gasps> <gasps> okay. Okay, 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 okay. How many are there? I wonder if this is like a pinwheel fight where, um, cover blown, yeah. Uh, where only one is the real one. But they all seem kind of similar. Oh boy, this is a nightmare. As you wish. Okay. Hello? Oh! Did it work this time? Let's not activate that one. I see. No, 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 no. Don't do that one. You're screwed, lady. Drain life. Oh, again. So, maybe one of these is the real one again. Hmm. She doesn't even have the regular, like... <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, it's it's the Dragon Age term, right? For the thing. She doesn't even have this, this arcane bolt. It would be useful right now. Okay. Let's do Winter's Grass. Okay, it was the right one. Now a Lyrian potion. Use it well, Morrigan. You're finished. Haha. <laughs> Hello, K okay, Brown Brown. I just, uh, defeated a demon. Or Morrigan did.
I shouldn't think the Arl should be upset that I saved his son instead of his wife. It was her witch after all. Oh, this is sad. What a mess. So it is over. Connor is his old self. He does not seem to remember anything, which is a blessing. I suppose we will need to send him to the Circle of Magi's Tower for... training, once the war is over. It's so odd to think of the boy as a mage, of all things. Should Eamon recover? I'm not sure how I will tell him of all this. Isolde is dead, yet her sacrifice saved their son. There is still the matter of Jowan. He performed the ritual and did not deceive us. In a way, he saved Connor's life even though he killed his soul. I am unsure what to make of this. We will hold him for Eamon to decide his fate. If he doesn't recover, Jowan's fate is sealed. What do you think? Hmm. Ned Stark. Poor Ned. I don't think it's your decision to make. What do you mean? He is responsible for many of the problems here and is a Maleficar as well. He is the Circle of Magi's responsibility. Perhaps you are correct. But that is Eamon's decision, not mine. I'm sorry. Jowan stays in the dungeon for now. But our task is not done yet. Whatever the demon did to my brother, it seems to have spared his life, but he remains comatose. We cannot wake him. As odd as it may seem, the quest Isolde sent the knights on may be our only hope. We must find the urn of sacred ashes. Okay. Part two of the Red Cliff quest, I guess. Mm. The urn is a legend. It might never be found. That is a possibility. But there is a reason it's still an option. I am not simply grasping at straws. Eamon funded the research of a Denerim scholar, a brother Genetivi. He has been trying to decipher the inscriptions on Andraste's birth rock. When Eamon fell ill, Isolde sent her knights to Genetivi in the hopes that he had finally discovered the location of Andraste's final resting place. They were unable to find him. In desperation, Isolde sent others in search of the brother or some clue of the urn's location. Uh, yeah, it, it won't be necessary, Harbinger. <laughs> I kind of just, you know, would prefer not to get a bunch of tips at this point. Even for stuff I've done already. Um, uh, okay. And what do I get for seeking out this urn? I have nothing to give you, except if we are fortunate, my brother and the armies he can muster. But for that, we need the urn. If you wish more, speak with him once he is revived. Well, it's true that, you know, if you want him as an ally, he could hardly refuse it if we, you know, did all this for him, saved his son, found the urn. What will you be doing in the meantime? I must organize Eamon's knights as they return, draft new soldiers, and prepare the army to fight. I shall hand Redcliffe back to Eamon when he awakens, and in a state where it can be of some use in the coming war. Truly, what other choice do I have? I will see if I can find this relic. No one else can. Even if I wish to do it myself, I cannot abandon Redcliffe to its own devices. Perhaps you could seek out the brother's home in Denerim and see if any clues remain on his whereabouts. It is the only place to begin the search, I think. I must go to the hall and begin rebuilding. I wish you luck, and may the Maker go with you. Denerim. The place of... Well, where the... 
The Magi guys keep my blood. Hello, Guardian, and thank you for hosting. Appreciate it. How are you doing today? How did the... Uh, did, did you do any more solo training yesterday? So, now she levels up. Magic. Let's put it to 25. Willpower. Constitution. Seems good. Alright, good. Uh, next. Oh, what should we choose for her? Another combat slot would be kind of nice, I guess. Poison making as well. I'm gonna go with poison making, actually. You've been doing plant yesterday. Uh, you're, you're going to, to do solos today? It's nice. I don't know if she really needs this though. Arcane Bolt. It's one of the few things that appear to have a uh, long range. But let's give her. I'm a little tempted to give her heal so we have two healers. Yeah, let's do it. Because if, if Rialda goes down. We have no healers. Alistair too. Constitution. Let's make him tankier. And strength. Unwavering Courage grants bonuses to damage, physical resistance, and mental resistance, as well as a bonus to critical chance that increases proportionally to the number of enemies above two that the warrior is engaging. Sounds pretty good. It's a passive. Uh... Hold on, did you successfully complete a shadow solo? That's nice. I have never soloed with the shadow, I believe. Yes. History of Ferelden. Oh, that's nice. Let's create a save game. Oh, that's uh that's too bad. Book. Very well. I'm just gonna read the codexes off stream. Hello. Alright, let's go find us the urn, I guess. Where is Denerim on the map? Over here. It's on the other side of the kingdom. Largest city and main port. It is also the location of the royal palace. Mm -mm. Okay. We can probably visit the village, although I suspect it's going to be a little emptier at this point. Servant. That poor little boy. I just can't bear to think what he must have gone through. The boy is fine, and he can't even remember it. Ah, oh, here he is. You. You're the one who saved me. It was Marion. Then. I guess I owe her thanks. Father always said to remember to thank people who do nice things for you. I wish mother were here. Nobody will tell me how she died. They say I'll find out when I'm older. 
Yep. Oh, she didn't approve. Okay. That poor little boy. Oh yeah, yeah. He must have gone through. Hopefully, no shits about is is gonna go down right now, since we got the auto save. <laughs> Servant guards. Yes. Chest. Ah. Nice. Hello, Wisco Tangy. <laughs> Missed a lot. Oh, uh, well... Perhaps. <laughs> hey, McRaptor. Yeah, well, an autosave is always, you know, an indication that something... Something... Might just happen. Okay. Can't unlock. There was still something this way. As you say. Gift. <clears throat> Size, thank you for hosting. This book traces the line of Arl Eamon back to the time of the Alamari clans. It doesn't seem to have been read much. Huh. I wonder who might like that. Tactical view when exploring. <laughs> it's true, you can see. This feels like playing The Sims. I kind of prefer, you know... Seeing my character a bit more closely. Yeah, up close. Vault. Where am I going? Main floor. Oh, hold on. I missed uh, a door. What? No. Ah, here. I guess I was done with that area. Hello, size. You know, I saw your tweet about Stellaris. I checked that game out a few days ago. Put it on my wish list. I'm very intrigued to hear what you uh, have to say about it. Desk. Of course. Alistair's mother's amulet. I wonder who might appreciate this gift. <laughs> I I noticed it yesterday that size had gone turbo. Can't unlock. Oh, there there's actually a lock on the symbol. Scale armor. Huh? Let's take it. I'll take it. This could come in handy. Can't unlock that one either. Sir Perth, who's luckily still alive. Hopefully he's stopped hallucinating. He did not want to stop fighting. Oh, thank goodness. Potions. Even uh, long after the battle was over, he just kept being sort of triggered. Turbo face. <laughs> Night. Hello, Ban. You return. 
But you have news. I would like to talk about Jowen. What of him? He awaits my brother's decision on his fate. Oh wait, we went over this already. I would like him released. No, I cannot do that. He almost killed my brother. If Eamon wishes to pardon the mage, he will, when he awakes. I guess I failed. Are you calling Eamon's knights back? Yes, but they are returning slowly. No doubt the war's progress, as well as the Darkspawns, hinders many of them. What's his condition? Unchanged, I'm afraid. We've tried more magical healing, but nothing works. As time passes, I become more and more convinced the urn might be our only hope. <laughs> oh, you get lost trying to find the main entrance? Yeah, I just try to, you know, go in some direction I haven't been before. Then I must resume my duties. The civil war continues, and Loghain is no doubt angered Redcliffe has not been disabled. Good luck, my lady. You are a great and noble woman. I hope it continues to go well, for all our sakes. See, we kind of flirted with this guy back before this mess started. Sir Perth, good to see you in, uh, in good health. It is good you resolve this demon business. Now we must either revive the Arl or allow Van Tegan to take his place. Let's see. Courtyard. Oh, that's where I came from. We could explore the place a bit. See if we can steal something. I mean, uh, <clears throat> claim our, our gifts. No, I guess there's nothing here. I don't know. Looks like I've been here already. No. No others have been uh, kicked. No! Basement cellar. No, 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 no. Okay, I'm lost. Second floor. Ah, here we go. Courtyard. Success. <laughs> it's cool. I was just, you know, testing if, if you guys were lost. Okay. So we open the main gate. I guess when you come out, come back out here, you would notice that you can actually, you can open the gate. Maybe keep an eye out for that next time you, uh, you do this battle. Oops, too far. Okay. Yeah, I did kind of uh, experiment on one of one of my companions. I was like, if I if I say I don't want them here, will will they really leave? Hey, I want to visit the the village. What, Denerim? I bring word, sire. There are demands from the Banorn that you step down from the Regency. They are said to be gathering their forces, as are oh. your allies. It appears it will be civil war after all, despite the Darkspawn. Pity. I also have an interesting report. There seem to be Grey Wardens who survived Ostagar. How, I don't know. But they will act against you. I have arranged for a... a solution. With your leave. The Antivan Crows send their regards. An assassin? Against Grey Wardens, we will need the very best. <laughs> <laughs> and the most expensive. Just get it done. <laughs> Hmm. 
He doesn't look too happy. Zev... Zevron. Zevron. Arene. Aranai. Arani. I don't know how to say this. English spelling, or I mean pronunciation, you know, rules don't really help me. Hey, Matuska. Oh, you need to work. Okay, well, thanks for lurking. Yeah, I, I freeze my people. They know I do it because I, I'm fond of them. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. They don't take it personally. <laughs> and they know I do it, you know, because of tactical reasons. So they don't blame me for making poor decisions in combat. I'm sure of this. Hey, Peach. Welcome. The crows send their regards. Between the Taviner Imperium, Rivain, and the Free Marches sits the nation of Antiva. Although it possesses few resources of its own, Antiva's location makes it a center for trade in the north, and the capital, Antiva City, is the wealthiest in the world. Antiva has virtually no army. The monarchy is too weak to support one. Most Antivans would be hard-pressed even to name the current king, as the true power lies in the hands of a dozen merchant princes, each with a personal army and each locked in a constant struggle for power against all the others. Anyone would think then that Antiva would be a ripe target for invasion by one of her neighbors, but even the Kunari leave Antiva alone, for one very good reason, the House of Crows. The most efficient, most feared, and most expensive guild of assassins in the world calls Antiva their home, and their uh, reputation alone defends the borders. Impressive. Ate some food. You've been feeling unwell? Right, so we need to go. Hold on, where do we go? World map, world map. Let's check out if, uh, oh, hey, we needed to check, check, check this thing. Lost in the castle. We told her to run. I mean, I don't know what else we could have done. We need to check on the blacksmith's, blacksmith's girl. Oh, by the way, before we do that, I should probably take a break. It's been... It's been well over an hour. A self-inflicted? Oh. <laughs> I see. I see. Oh well, I will play some music for you guys. You're 